Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of Tacky Tuesday. This is where we go over different EMS cardiology lessons and this week we're going to be going over ventricular tachycardia with a pulse. Ventricular tachycardia is defined as an abnormally rapid heart rate that originates in the ventricles of the heart or the bottom of the heart. The heart is unable to fill with blood and pump properly due to the rapid speed at which the ventricles are firing. And it should be noted that three or more PVCs or premature ventricular contractions constitutes a run of ventricular tachycardia. Taking a look at some of the ventricular tachycardia characteristics, your rate is going to be between 100 and 250 beats per minute, typically. It is a regular rhythm, and there is no P wave, therefore there is no PR interval, and your QRS complexes are going to be extremely wide. VTEC with a pulse can be caused by several different things. A heart attack, heart failure, previous heart disease or heart injury, hypoxia, hypokalemia, other underlying health issues, and also drug or stimulant usage. Treatment of VTAC with a pulse in the 911 EMS setting heavily depends on if they are stable or unstable. But nonetheless, these possible treatments can include oxygen. Obviously, we always want to put oxygen on these patients and gain IV access because even if they are stable or unsymptomatic at the time, um, they may quickly turn unstable and symptomatic. You can also administer amiodarone or lidocaine, adenosine, procainamide, sodalol, and cardioversion if they are unstable. And always with these patients, definitely a rapid transport to the hospital. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye!